Welcome to Food Fight Showdown. On today's episode, we've got a showdown. Canned chili. I have eight different kinds of canned chili. Which one's the best? Let's check this out. Cue the intro. Food Fight Showdown. You want answers? I think I'm entitled. You want answers? I want the truth! You can't handle the truth! Before we try these chilies, I'd like to tell you a little bit about my rating scale. I like to rate on a scale from zero to 100, with zero being it's terrible, and 100 being really, really good. Okay, this is chili number one, armor chili with no beans. This is what it looks like. Okay, let's try our first chili. First one I'm going to try is armor chili. See how it tastes. It's okay. Uh, it has a little bit of heat. I tried to get all of these in the mild. Um, it doesn't have a really good taste. I would probably give this a rating of, I'm going to go 35. It's, it's okay chili, but I, I wouldn't recommend that one. Okay, our second one here is Hormel Chili with Beans. That's what it looks like. Let's try our next one. I've had this one before. Or melt chili with beans. Let's check it out. It's better, but not not great. I'm probably going to give this a rating of. Um, um, I'll go 40 on this one. Still not great. It's okay. Spice level is, is decent. Not very tasty. I'd pass on that one as well. Okay, our next one is Campbell's Chunky with Beans. And this is what it looks like. Our next one is Chunky chili with beans. Let's see how it tastes. That's a little better. Still not great, but it does have a better taste than the last two. I would probably go. I'm gonna go that one to 50. It's not bad. The best so far. Okay, here's our next chili. Great value, the generic. See what it looks like. Our next one is the generic chili from Walmart. See how it does. okay as well. It might be our bottom actually. Not very spicy. Not very tasty. I'm going 25 on that one. Okay, here's our next chili. Wolf brand chili in the mild. That's what it looks like. Our next one, we're going to try the wolf brand chili. See how it tastes. It's kind of thick. This one's meaty. Mm. It's 
got a decent taste, not great, better than a lot of them. I'm probably going to go, I'll give this one a 42, it's okay. Our next one is Skyline Original Chili. This is what it looks like. I will tell you that this one seems to be different than all the rest. It's a lot thinner. This should be interesting to see how it tastes. Okay, let's try our next one. This one's a popular one. You hear about it a lot. I hope it's good. It's the Skyline Chili. Let's give it a shot. Now this one seems to be a lot more soupy than a lot of the other ones. Let's see how it tastes. Right off the bat, I kind of get a cinnamon taste to it. It is a little bit more spicy. It's got a horrible wing to it. I don't like it at all. Um, I'm going to give this a rating of 5. It's the, probably the worst chili I've ever had in my life. Okay, here's our next one. It's Steak and Shake of the Original Chili with Beans. And this is what it looks like. Next one we're going to try, I've had many times in the restaurant, it's Steak and Shake. Let's check this out. Okay, that's got a good taste. Tastes very similar to what's in the store. It does, even though I got most of these in the mild, that's got some nice heat to it. It's got a good taste. I like the, uh, it's got the big beans in it. I guess they're big red beans. The meat's good, the sauce is good. Probably the best so far. I'm probably gonna give this one a rating of um, 63. Okay, Amy's Organic Chili, and this is what it looks like. Okay, we've come to our last one. It is Amy's Organic Chili. I really don't know what to expect with this one. It did have a different look than the other chilies. So let's see how it tastes. It, it has a look of homemade chili, I'll tell you that right off the bat. Um, that's the closest we come to like a homemade chili. Um, it does, I did, I did have to get this one in the medium, but it's not too spicy. I think it has just about the right amount of spice, but it has a fresh taste, almost like um, homemade. Uh, I like it a lot. I, I think it might be our best one so far. I'm gonna give this one a rating of 72. Pretty good for canned chili. Okay, as we sum this thing up, um, the best chili that we tried was Amy's Organic. Our second place finisher was Steak and Shake. Our third place finisher was Campbell's Chunky. Our fourth place finisher was Wolf Brand Chili. And our fifth place finisher, Hormel Chili. Our sixth place finisher, Armor Chili with beans or with no beans. Our seventh place finisher was Great Value Walmart's brand. And our last place finisher was Skyline Original Chili. Of all of these, the ones, the two that I would not recommend 
would be the Walmart and the Skyline and the two that I would recommend the Amy's and the Steak and Shake well that's all I have for you today don't forget to like subscribe and ring that notification bell we'll see you on the next video Food fight! Showdown.